How's it going everyone? Phil here from Ferris Technology. If you just ordered your Peloton bike or you already have one, I've got five top accessories that I would highly recommend that you pick up for your Peloton. Let's go ahead and get started with the most obvious one that you can see. It is this custom padded seat. So you can replace the seat on your Peloton bike with a much more comfortable seat. The seat that's included in the box with the Peloton, it is very uncomfortable. It's just not meant for everybody. I don't know, if, if you're just one of those people that ride and you stand up on your bike all the time and you're just a really hard rider on your bike, then sure, maybe you don't really care too much about the seat. But for any average person that gets a Peloton bike, it's a must have to get a comfortable seat. I know it doesn't look the prettiest, it's not the most sporty looking seat of anything, but you know what? You're not gonna regret it once you get this and you do your first ride. So much more comfortable. It's got springs underneath for the uh, help of padding and stuff like that. It's just a way more comfortable seat for the Peloton bike, so I'd highly recommend that. And everything that I'm gonna talk about today in this video, I'm gonna link in the description box below, so you make sure you check those out for current pricing and the exact stuff that I talk about will be in the link below. All right, let's go to our our next one, which is this high density mat. So the mat is really, really nice. So you can see I do have my bike on a hardwood floor, but the mat protects my floor. So you're putting a lot of impact down on when you're riding and stuff like that, and it's pressuring into the ground a lot. So it's really, really good to have a high density mat. And this mat is not too expensive, and it's very, very high quality, and it definitely protects your floor, it's stable on your bike. It's just a really, really good mat and it fits perfectly as you can see. So it's a little bit bigger than the actual bike itself, but that's what you want. You want something that's like a great looking mat that protects your floor. So I'd highly recommend getting a good mat for your Peloton. All right, let's go on to the next thing that we have right here. And as you can see, We've got the two water bottle holders, and I do have two things in the water bottle holders. And the first thing I would recommend is this bottle. So this is the Camelback insulated bottle. I know a lot of you have water bottles and stuff like that, and you're like, well, why do I need another water bottle? This is insulated, so it keeps your water cool and cold. So you can actually put ice cubes and stuff in this, and you can come back like five hours later, and it's still gonna have the ice in there. Your water's gonna be super cold all the time. And it's got the splash thing on here, so you can just take it and take a quick, wig with it and you're good to go. So it's highly recommend this bottle. It's very, very nice. And also it fits perfectly into the little holder on the Peloton bikes. So it's a perfect bottle for your Peloton. Grab one of those. Again, I'll link it down below for you guys if you wanna know what the current pricing is. There is actually two different sizes of it, but they both fit in here. One's just a little bit longer. Uh, so you can choose between the two different sizes. All right, moving on to our next thing right here. It is this speaker. Now, your Peloton bike, yes, it does have speakers built into it, but they're behind the screen on the average uh, Peloton, on, on not the plus variation, just the regular uh, Peloton. But the speakers on the Peloton are horrible. They're very, very bad. So I would recommend getting a custom speaker. Now, why this speaker? This is a JBL charge speaker. And why would I recommend this one? Well, one, it's really, really good bass. Number two, it fits into here perfectly into your little cup holder side. So you can have your bottle and your speaker on one side. The other thing, which is really, really cool about the speaker, the Charge 2 speaker, it's called a JBL Charge because it actually has a little USB port in here. So you can actually charge your phone with this USB port. But you're saying, well, where do I put my phone? Where do I put my phone? Well, we've got this phone holder, custom phone holder that I've put right up on top of here. So it's a little tray, it's a plastic tray, and it connects via bands that wrap around. Now you might say, oh my gosh, well, they're just rubber bands, it's not gonna be stable. This is rock solid when you put the bands on. This is perfectly made for the Peloton bike, so it works fantastic, I absolutely love it. Now let me show you how this tray works. You can see it's just a plastic tray, and I do have this rubber pad on here. I actually purchased this rubber pad separately, and this is also a must have a rubber pad like this so that your phone doesn't roll around. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put my phone down into here, we'll turn it off right now, and you can see my phone is super, super stable, it doesn't move. So while you're riding hard on your bike, it's not gonna move your phone around. The other really cool thing that I love about this is you can stand your phone up just like that, right there, and there. Now if you wanna FaceTime someone or you wanna look at your messages or anything like that, just look at how perfect placement this is for your phone. It's perfectly just right in your eye level. You can see your screen and your phone perfectly fine. And this little rubber pad right here will help stabilize it as well. So your phone's not gonna fall down or anything while you're riding rough on it. Now there's another phone holder that people have got where it's got a little slot right here and it kind of stands right here. But if you just look, your phone just right down here, 
it's not in your eye level, it's too low. And you're looking up at your screen right here and you're not gonna be able to see it. So having your phone with this little tray right here, it's perfect. I absolutely love this. And I can just put my phone down if I want to and ride along and not worry about my phone. So really, really great. And then obviously because you have that charge port right here on your J Bill charge, you can connect a cable from here to your phone and you can charge your phone at the same time that you're riding. So the speaker meshes very well, fits perfectly, meshes in with your phone holder. It's just an all around great option. So those are some fantastic accessories that I would highly recommend for the Peloton bike. If you guys have any other recommendations for other accessories, let me know in the comment section down below. Also, make sure you check out the current pricing. I will link everything down below in the description as well as the comments, guys. Thank you very much for watching this video. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.